Hey YouTube, Richard Scott here. It is January 31st of 2019 and we're going to be feeding the bees. I've got about 40 hives that I'm going to beef up with some sugar water and I'll show you how to do that in the process. And we're in central Alabama, Northport, Alabama, and we've got about a month and a half to go before we really start to see a lot of pollen and nectar. Uh, so the bees can start building up their supply for the springtime. So I'm going to just help them out a little bit, make sure they got plenty to make it through the rest of winter. we got about a week or so worth of warm weather coming up with 60s and 70s, and uh, that's a perfect time to do some outdoor feeding. That's how I feed my hives. I use a kiddie pool with sugar water. And it's an outdoor method of feeding the bees. It's very effective, and it's a pretty cool process to see, especially when the bees cover the hay and the sugar water. Uh, it, it's really neat. Lots of sugar. Got to have lots of sugar for this kind of stuff. These are 55 gallon drums and two of these are full of sugar. One is about a quarter to a halfway full. And look at all that sugar. Bees are going to love this. So if you notice I'm putting hay on the sugar water and all this does just keeps the bees from drowning so they'll be able to stand on the hay and, and drink the water like that so just a little tip that helps save some bees just like that ready to go got some hay and some debris in here that way the bees won't drown whenever they come get it and it will not take long at all and this will be covered in bees Hey, here's a little video. This is from back in the summer, just showing you what it looks like whenever the bees are taking the sugar water. And it is so cool to see there'll be thousands and thousands of bees drinking the sugar water at one time. Uh, the most I've ever had a drink in one day was about 40 gallons. So they can take down a lot of sugar water if they need it. And again, this is just kind of beef them up and get them ready for springtime and kind of fill the gap between now and spring. 